Um, so, so describe your thoughts as, as the game is winding down. You're at the free throw line shooting what looks to be the, the game winning free throw tied at 51. What was, what was going through your mind? Uh, I knew I had to get the free throws. I missed the critical ones, but I got the ball back and wanted to like, regain myself, so I made the next one. This had to be such a fun game for you girls. Back and forth, back and forth at the end. Yeah, it was ridiculous. Uh, I think energy gets us going. I think the closer the closer the games, the more it shows out of people. You were down by at one point nine points in the third quarter, and you really just seemed to kind of put it upon yourself, take it upon yourself to, to get your team back, and you kind of willed your team back into this one. What changed that allowed you to go up to get on that roll? Uh, I felt like I had to attack the rim. I feel like when you start to attack the rims, it opened up shots for everyone else and creates other shots that people can hit. You, you created some openings. Uh, Sydney had a couple of key threes there to get you guys back in. Yeah, I just I attack her side. I know she's. I know I can trust her taking the shot, so I pass it through. It kind of came down to you guys needing a couple defensive stops there real late in that game. Um, what was Coach saying in, in those timeouts? He said we got to finish possessions. Uh, basically, loose balls, 50 50 balls had to be ours. Box out, get the rebound, run. Girls are now three and zero. Is is it? You know, I don't want to say you know fortunate to feel three and zero, but you know in a game like this that it could have ended you know either way. Um, you know it has to be a good feeling walking away undefeated at this point. Yeah, definitely. Uh, coach told us that every game we restart to one and zero. We try to go one and zero every single game. Congratulations. Thank you very much.